You know what season it is? It's spooky season. Hey guys, welcome back to Dark Angel Beauty. I'm so excited because I have been celebrating Halloween, at least internally and somewhat externally, since we had the Halloween night in August while we were at Disney. But it is finally time to accept that I can celebrate it out loud for the world. As we're filming this, it's like the end of September. Um, there are Halloween decorations everywhere. And I've already purchased some for my own usage. We bought a spooky tree at Target yesterday for $5. I got some little baby pumpkins for the desk at Walmart for like a dollar. I got this awesome mug, which is just like everything about it, for like $3 at Walmart. But because I enjoy decorating and I enjoy holidays and I enjoy um, purchasing things that are unnecessary, um, and also because Halloween is literally everything about me as a person, I celebrate it as long as I possibly can. I have Halloween decorations that stay up year round and I love it so much. My job asked me to decorate for Halloween. So I was given a $40 budget and of course when I have $40 and a whole store to decorate, I'm going to take myself on down to Dollar Tree. So we went to Dollar Tree tonight. Um, tomorrow I'm bringing the stuff to work uh, and then after I finish doing what I do, I will help them decorate. But I figured you guys would like to see the really awesome selection of products that Dollar Tree offers. Um, like I said, my budget was $40. After tax, I spent $39.68 because your girl can keep in a budget as well. So I have a lot of stuff. I'm just gonna go through it really quickly to show you guys and I'll kind of give you an idea of like where I'm planning on putting it in the store. Uh, if you're wondering about my awesome hat, it did not come from Dollar Tree. It came from my mom's online shopping addiction, but thanks mom. Uh, I figured it would be useful for this uh, particular video and you guys will see it a lot during our Halloween inspired uh, videos. So without further ado, I'm going to jump right in. Dollar Tree, if you guys have never been to one because you live under a rock or something, that's fine. Um, basically the concept is it is a dollar store, but everything in it is a dollar, not like some of the other ones where they may have like, you know, price range of like to a dollar to like $10 or whatever. So everything here is a dollar, which is how I was able to get so much stuff. So the first thing I got were these cute little um, hanging things. They have like little hangers up top. Like you could hang it off a door, you could hang it um, from a window or something like that. What I thought, what I had in mind is that I probably would put them on a, um, to be put a little piece of tape and put them on a window or something. So I got a ghosty and I got a, a pumpkin with a little hat because you know I love my witches. Um, and then because obviously we're a fast food restaurant, so I saw this little sign and I thought it would be perfect for our theme. It says eat, drink, and be scary. Um, I was thinking that probably would go around the front counter somewhere. And then... There's four type concepts of these, but I was thinking we have four tables for people who decide to dine in with us. And um, I was thinking one for each table. Then I got this big old bowl. And Nikki actually found this one. And it's like a really nice, like durable plastic bowl. Uh, it's got little spiders, a little spider web. And um, I figured he suggested during like on Halloween day, we can actually put some little candy in it for the kids who come by. And I thought that was a really good idea. Um, so I was thinking that probably would wind up sitting up on our front counter somewhere. I'm gonna have to put it back in the bag as I do this, just so I still have room. Bag number two, there's a lot of bags, just prepare. So Nikki also found these. We had a lot of fun. We both, because we both love Halloween so much that, I mean like we were literally shopping the whole time and we're like, we want this, we want this, we want this. And I was like, yo, I just gotta do the work stuff first so I can keep it separate. And then we'll come back for us. Um, so yeah, so he found these cute little pumpkins and I mean, they could go honestly anywhere. We could put one in the drive through window. We could put one up front. It doesn't really matter. But they do have like little um, battery operated things. And there's like a little built-in candle. So I'm sure when we pull this tab out, you'll be able to see him lit up. I'm not going to do that because I want to save him for the Halloween season. Um, this is another one of the little table decorators that I picked up. It was a little pumpkin. We also purchased four of these for each of the tables. Um, and then got a ghosty. And then we got another witch hat. I like the witch hats the best. So that's why we got two of those. Um, they did have like a little rest in peace 
like tombstone one too i was trying really hard not to make something that was going to be like too scary because they had like some really cool skeletons and stuff which for me i love but i'm also like i don't know like this is a family friendly restaurant i don't know if they're going to be okay with that so i didn't do it if it were up to me i would have had like a lot of gore out there but they, they don't want that so um, and then we got these necklaces. Uh, every time I've shopped, they've sent me to shop a couple times for Halloween or for uh, different holiday decorations. And I, every time I pick up at least two of these so that the staff can wear these around their neck when they are um, working and have like a little bit of a festive spirit as well. Um, and then I picked these up uh, for our donut case. Um, we have a really pretty glass one and it's got two sections to it. So I figured these could go along the top of each one of those. Bag number three. I think there are six total, but I'm not entirely sure. Um, there's not a lot in this one because they're kind of like awkward, but some more little hangy things. I love the pumpkins with the little witches hats and like, I'm almost positive you guys are gonna see within a couple days, like a bunch of this kind of stuff hanging behind me. Cause for a dollar, I'm pretty sure Nikki and I are gonna go back and go like hog wild. <laughs> like I said, we got, I mean, we got like 36 items or something like that and paid $39 for it. So how do you beat that? Um, and then these guys, I picked these guys up because they're just really cute. And I figured, you know, scarecrows are kind of all fall. So even after Halloween, we can get by leaving these up. Um, and then I got this one, Chiro. This is a little pretty one that says trick or treat. It's got glitter. And you know, I love glitter. So, and I also like purple. So it was just a lot that I liked in that one. And I also just like Halloween and I just loved everything. Uh, this one is also a pretty lightweight bag. These, oh no, my bow is bent. Oh well, it'll be fine. It was a dollar. Um, I got these with the intention of putting them on the men's and women's room. So I was thinking this one for the men's room and this one for the ladies' room. I was trying to find something that'll like stick nicely to the door. And a lot of times I get the little hangy things and then I have to tape those and then they wind up falling. And uh, that's never good, so. All right, and then this one says, uh, happy, oh, that's backwards. It says, happy Halloween. And it's pretty and black and glittery. And I figured that one, again, would be a nice thing to just kind of hang somewhere, have it around. I'm going quick now. Super speed. Uh, we got four little buckets. And once again, I was thinking maybe i put them on the tables. But if not, I just like having even numbered stuff. Um, I got two of these because these were the cutest. And I'm almost positive I'm going back to buy myself one of those. Um, and then we got this little one. And this little one with the haunted house on it. So those, I mean, we could put anything in them. We could fill it with... I don't know. It's straws. I don't know. And then last bag. Uh, this is the equal, the matching little pumpkin for the black one. It's the little orange one. He also lights up. Ugh. This stuff. So we got hanging ghosty. I figured he wasn't too scary. A little hanging ghosty. Oh, the dog likes the hanging ghosty. Okay, no, stop. Go. Oh, bye bye. Um, this I was thinking it's like a creepy mesh. Like my whole life is creepy mesh. But um, I think that we're gonna hang that in the drive through window. And then uh, these two little candles are really cool too. I did get one little thing with skulls on it to put my little mark on it. Um, and that one has pumpkins. And then this is just a pretty fall bowl. And I got these little things that I figured we could put inside of it and keep on the front counter even um, during Thanksgiving and all of that as well. So a lot of stuff, uh, basically 40 items that I just threw at you. I did get all of it done and miraculously, but I had a lot of fun doing this. I always do. We spent like a good 30, 40 minutes in Dollar Tree, just like, ha, 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 ha. So um, a lot of fun, a uh, lot of really good stuff. So if you have a local Dollar Tree and you're looking to decorate affordably a dorm, your house, whatever, there's a great amount of stuff available there. And I would highly recommend it. Um, Nikki and I are definitely going to go back and purchase stuff for our filming area. Um, so yeah, I'm excited. I really wanted to share it with you and I'm glad you guys watched the video. Hope you, hopefully you liked it. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe because we're very close to hundred and we really want to do our giveaway. As always, I love you guys very much. As you can tell, I'm very excited for spooky season and to share that with you guys. I hope you have a wonderful night and you stay girly with a dark twist. Perfect.